And you need to see Dignitas be able to block these clears from Maus and stop that transition coming out. And that's what usually makes Dignitas so good in that land environment. They're always able to sniff out the clears, but this one they can't get a hold of. And a lot will turn in again the first goal. Well, I was wondering when we see it from a lot, the solo play comes through and a missed touch from Violet Panda. A lot will make you pay when he can set it up like that. And Maus once again, start off with land. He takes that one away. Oh, I wonder if that pass off the side wall and well read by AJ to take it away, but actually Rizzo kind of gets bumped into position. Jim to lift into the midfield. Oh, got the up, and that will be into the back of the net. What a play for Rizzo. Wow, Rizzo, what a play from him, like you said, and a great half lift to get that boost. It's what allows him to pull off this play. He gets the big bump, passes it out. j -Nap's there to put it away. G2, a spectacular play to start. They've been continuing to keep that possession, but Cloud9's been a brick wall. Torment. Oh, midfield, that's not going to be anyone for Cloud9. Rizzo getting in the face of gimmick. j shoots and scores! G2 force game five! G2 and game five. Name a more iconic duo, Jorby. There is none in Rocket League. Or else he has seasoned. Bluey, he has seen success before. Ooh. He made the bold move. Boom. like Cut off the backboard, and here comes Flakes from the top of the box towards the top oh. right. Looks into the net. Flakes delivers again in game three. You ask him to step up, and how about that? Kadok clears it straight to Flakes, picks it up, gets the double tap off the back wall, and Vitality can do nothing. Remco got Justin to beat, and it bangs off the corner. Fireburner looking for Justin, broken up by Metz. Garrett G shot, ball for Remco! Garrett G! Oh my goodness! NRG battled back! The pass was cut out, but then the play from Garrett and Justin, the give and go, it actually was bouncing out off the post, and it hit off a defense. Wonder and Kronovi, both confused on who was exactly going for that. And oh! oh! Big bullies in the nets. It's three to one for Mouse. That was so nasty. You feel bad for AJ. Speed off the side wall. Launches himself into AJ. I love the excitement from Speed. All right, Lars. Could go really, uh, really well. Yeah, and what do you think about the word uh, cherry picker? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Literally just when I walk off right now, right? <laughs> Unbelievable. <laughs> well, congratulations there a lot Thank on you. the victory that you were able to get there, man. And congratulations for making it into day three here. Thank you. Rudy's going to clear it out to the top. A nice chance there from Complexity, but it'll go the other way. Double tap opportunity for Flakes. Oh, he, he hits it. He hits it. Flakes with the double tap. Are you kidding me? A present play here from Flakes. You called it out yourself. A nice pass to from Martinez and a great follow-up. He'll double tap that right and give Flakes the lead in game number That was one. so good. RG, high touch, tough ask, and back wall. Oh. Justin needs help. Firebender there, CJ diving stop. He may not have got the goal, but at least he kept the lead. I got our managing to stay in this game with these saves. Oh my goodness. Gary G, you disgusting man. <laughs> the corner, keeps it close, and delivers a huge equalizer. With two minutes left, Garrett G back and forth between the backboard. What a play from him. This is for day three qualification. G2 fans everywhere, they ask why, G2? Why must you make it this way? And they say, this is why Rizzo! Rizzo! Six seconds in, self-pass off the corner, gets the read right over Torment in net. And that's what G2 needed. Rizzo delivers. From FC Barcelona is going to be none other than Bluey. Bluey, how did it feel there on the field? It felt like you had a lot of breathing room to kind of do what you guys wanted. Yeah, I felt really confident going into that game. Like before, and we, we played complexity in DreamHack qualifiers. We floor sweep them. So coming into this game, we were really confident, very happy with the result that we just put out. So tomorrow, on day number three, you play Evil Geniuses. How confident are you going uh, into that game? I mean, Evil Geniuses just demoted to the RLS, so... Oh, oh. wow, that's, uh, that's rough. I'm I mean, confident. it is just facts. It's just facts, and no, no hard feelings. Another infield pass, Torment and Gimmick. These guys have been finding each other all series, almost finding each other there for a goal. Rizzo has this off wide and is blocked. Try to get wide at Gimmick. To find the post, he couldn't. Shane Naps keeps the play off the backboard. Shot on target. Oh my goodness, Squishy Muffins! Oh, Squishy missed the first read, but made up for it with that second effort. Every, every little bit of hang time the ball has, they are up. 
to go for it here against Cloud9. I mean, you even saw Gimmick had full boost and he wasn't really able to get the ball out of his own half or start the counterattack, <laughs> but now Torment will just take matters into his own hands. Torment, the first touch, he comes off the ceiling. Gimmick makes that challenge and Torment still falling down and makes the touch. Pronovi does handle it, gets it by two attackers, and now Roger headed the other way. Again, slow there in midfield. Wonder couldn't get back to it in time. Tigre flips it up. Cornovi scored on. Now's a two-goal lead. Tigre with the scoop. Look at this one. He air rolls, gets under the <laughs> ball, <laughs> and <laughs> scooped it right over the defender. Nasty. Mechanical excellence from Tigre. These kids have to grow up fast, yeah. right? They have to play under this high-pressure situation. Uh, you were playing uh, in the RLCS when you were 15, right? So... What was that like for you, Turtle? It's, where... it's, it's really overwhelming. Yeah. It's almost like you don't know how to feel. You just want to get up there and try and play your best. But the, the funny thing is that you go in expecting to perform as you normally do. You're like, ah, I mean, I'm in front of a couple people. How can it make a difference? But then you get on stage and you start competing and you're just, you are so confused. You feel completely out of place and like you have no idea what's going on. Yeah, I bet. I, I, I honestly didn't know you, you were 15 when you competed. What <laughs> an incredible pinch. pinch for TSM. And the miss there. NRG scrambling back on defense. Can they recover? Well, Remco forces it across the box as it gets boomed away. Metzenars on the challenge in midfield. Remco sets up by Ignite. The shot just high off the backboard. Garrett G couldn't get it. It's free for Metzenaris, or free at least to take a shot. And he hit it right into Garrett. NRG thanking their lucky start. Just Justin on the turnaround. Blocked by Metzenaris. No one's back. That was the demo. Can he get the shot? At Up in the air if you like this. Boom, bop, easy, 